Hey everyone, it's Ashley. Welcome back to my channel. So I am so excited for today's video. If you've seen the thumbnail, you guys know it is my whiff box unboxing. So if you ordered a whiff box and you do not want to be spoiled with what's in the whiff box, this is your signal to click off the video because there will be spoilers. So I'll be sharing what came in the March whiff box. I've only seen a couple people post these. I don't know if like people's shipments have been super delayed this month because usually I'm not the person to be getting, first person to like get their whiff box. Usually a ton of people post before me. So I don't know what the deal is, um, but I'm really excited. The theme of this whiff box this month is spring cleaning. And trust me, do I ever need some spring cleaning? We only moved into this house in November, but trust me, <laughs> everyone needs a good spring cleaning. So if you don't know what a whiff box is, from Scentsy, we have a monthly, it's like a mystery box. Um, you can add it to your Scentsy Club if you want to get it monthly, sort of as a subscription, uh, but it's actually not subscription-based if you don't want it to be. You can order 10 boxes a month. You can order one every other month. It's totally up to you. You can see what's gonna be in the box and then order it for yourself if you don't want it to be a surprise. Um, but the cost is $30 and it's always valued at more than $30 in the box. If you subscribe to it in your Scentsy Club though, you get 10% off, so just a tip. Um, and you can schedule it to come to you monthly, so such a good deal. So I am going to share what is in this March spring cleaning Scentsy Whiff box. So like I said, it's a mystery box, so every month the items change. It's a big one. Let me move the box around here. Okay, so they typically come with this little flyer which gives you a little bit of an activity or just kind of like an overall theme, like a general, i to move this closer, um, just kind of gives you an idea of what the box is going to be about. So it has a little spray bottle that says good, clean, fun, and then a little sneak peek here. This is such a fun little flyer. So inside it says there's a chore game. So there's all these like little cutout ideas and they all say different things. The gist behind it is you cut them all apart and you know, put them in a hat or whatever, and then you pull them out and it's all about cleaning. So like the first one says, tidy up as much as you can in 15 minutes. I might have to pull these out myself. Um, if you have kids, it's really fun. It says kids choice, kids pick chores for grownups today. Um, switch cards with anyone and assign them a new uh, chore. So you can like pull out of here as a family. You could even do it with yourself. Um, it says you choose, pick any chore you want. I think it's just a really good idea um, to help you get a little bit of motivation, especially get your kids involved if you're doing some cleaning around the house. Um, I know I can use all the motivation to clean the house. So. So the first thing right on top is really interesting and kind of a little bit of a surprise that this was included. So this is a Swedish dishcloth and it has like little lemons. I'm gonna be honest, it says in the, it's a washcloth. It really feels like a thick cardstock almost. So I'm assuming you need to get it wet and maybe it does something, but this is really interesting that they included this in here because this is not something we typically sell or provide. Um, so I'm really curious to see. So I would say this is a whiff box exclusive. So I'm really curious, like it doesn't really say much instructions. It just says one washcloth. So I'm assuming you just get it wet and go. I don't know, <laughs> very interesting. So very exciting for this box. It's all about spring cleaning. I've never tried some of these products that are in here. And so the first one is actually the Scentsy Counter Clean in Lemon Verbena. And the funny thing is, is I'm gonna post a haul tomorrow, but I actually got um, a counter, I got a bundle of like the Classic Clean Scentsy and I got the counter clean in lemon verbena. And now I have this lemon verbena. So I was like, really? They're probably packaging my package, putting in my clean products and putting in the Scentsy Whiff box. Like, LOL, she's gonna have so many cleaning products. So this is the counter clean in lemon verbena. 
let me tell you what Cincy says about the counter clean. I just like, I had no idea obviously when I placed my order, but I was like, dang, I would have picked a different set if I would have known. Um, okay, counter clean, great for counters and so much more. This spray is perfect for everyday cleanups on any sealed surface. So I hear so many people talk about this, like they use it on everything. Um, pretty sure like stainless steel. I've personally never used it, so I can't wait. I will be getting, I'll be testing this out. Should I open these and smell them? I have my scissors right here and I'm gonna use them. So like I may as well. I usually don't open the stuff right here, but I think today's the day. Wow, they really have this sealed really well, so if you're concerned about um, that, it's very, very sealed. And these are coming with their spray nozzles. Oh my gosh, I can't open it. Jeez, am I doing something wrong? I just want to smell the scent, okay? That's literally all. Watch, it'll have a little thing. Oh my goodness. You guys, I apologize. I've just never tried the cleaning product, so I'm just very curious. Like, does this smell like the wax tester? I just, I gotta know. If I knew this would take this long, I would have prepared. Okay, I'm getting somewhere. Ooh, it smells good. It smells similar to the wax. Maybe not as fragrant, just like a little bit lighter than the wax. It honestly just smells like a nice kind of citrus, lemony, lime scent. So I'm excited about that. And yeah, I have two. So look at me go. Um, the next thing they included, which is actually a new release. Um, it was part of the summer collection and then it came back. It is the dish soap in Fiesta Lime. So there's no wax test or anything of this. So I've never smelled this. So I'm going in for this one as well. Um, Oh, it's actually really good. It's like, um, it's definitely a lime. It kind of smells like a lime, but like a regular dish soap too. Like, I feel like I'm getting like this, you know, like a regular dish soap when you spray it out and suds it up. Like there's almost like a salty element to it, which is really interesting. So I'm excited. Let's see what they say about the dish soap. Uh, high high, this high performance liquid easily removes food particles and grease while staying gentle on skin. So if that's a concern, if you're a hand dishwasher, um, we typically run a lot of our stuff through the dishwasher, but I do like if we have any must hand wash items, then I definitely use it. Um, so I'm excited to see how that goes. And then last, I'm so excited to smell this one as well. Um, it's pretty wrapped up. It's the bathroom cleaner in Squeeze the Day. So this actually has like a special nozzle because it like foams somewhat, I believe. Once again, I've never tried any of these products, so I'm really excited too. It says, this ammonia-free spray is formulated to remove mildew, soap scum, and grime with ease. So great for like the shower but I think this is also going to be great for like sinks, you know, when your like sink kind of gets that gunk on it or maybe, or maybe you um, are really good at cleaning and your soap doesn't get gunk on it. But uh, for me, that's not the case. <laughs> My sink definitely gets like that weird, that weird stuff on it, like by the drain kind of, and just like, you know, brushing your teeth and whatnot. We'll see if I can do this. I didn't get the plastic off very good. But squeeze the day is supposed to be like a sugar, uh, sh yeah, sugared lemon, like a sweet lemon kind of. Oh my gosh. The struggle is real, you guys. Yes, this definitely smells like a lemon. Once again, it's pretty light, but it definitely doesn't smell chemically. Like, you know how when you clean your bathroom, like soap scum, it just smells like straight up chemicals. Ugh, it's disgusting. 
it's fairly light, but it definitely smells like lemon. So I'm very, very excited about that. Um, yeah, I'm assuming it's the, you have to use this nozzle to get it to do that as opposed to like this nozzle, if you can see. Okay. I'm sorry. This is taking so long. I should have prepared. Okay. Last two things in there. There is the current scent of the month, pink sugarberry mint, which is really good. Oh, it's cold. So it's sliding right out. I'm really excited that they included the new bar style. So if you are just like a regular, you know, not Scentsy consultant, you just buy Scentsy and you bought the Wick box, you're gonna get the new um, style of bars. Otherwise, I think they're slowly rolling them out. Right now they're just coming in like the consultant scent of the month kit. I really like this bar. I still need to decide if it's like club worthy for me. I'm still on a limb. Okay, and then lastly, the most exciting part, we did get a sample cup of next month's scent of the month, which is Plumeria Peach. The notes, just like a brief overview, is ripe pineapple, luscious peach blended sweetly over a bed of blooming Plumeria. Is that a flower? <laughs> it's a really pretty color. It looks more peach. Um, I feel like on camera it looks more red. So I'm gonna bust into this because I'm gonna warm this, probably today, honestly. Oh, this is interesting. What were the notes again? I'm, oh, that really got my hands all sticky. This is interesting. I'm not sure how I feel about this. I, I feel like I get a little bit of fruitiness, but a decent amount of floral. It says, pineapple, cassis, cucumber, jasmine, peach, plumeria. I feel like I'm getting the floral. Musk, raspberry, woods, and amber. I am getting a little bit of the muskiness, honestly. It's not very strong in this. I mean, this is on cold, obviously. So I'm not sure how I feel. It kind of... It's in the fruity category, but it's kind of reading like perfumey a little bit to me, which is odd. I feel like the this plastic smells more than this. Weird. Okay, so I'm not exactly positive how I feel about that. I've to me it's like a fruity perfumey kind of like Mad for Melon has like that perfumey floral esque note to it within the like fruit i'm not getting much peach or pineapple like cute what does cucumber smell like watery i don't know that's very very strange i i don't know why i was expecting that to smell different based on pineapple peach i don't know what plumeria smells like so that is my two cents. <laughs> I will warm this and share it in my what i've been warming because i'm very curious to see how this does um honestly though this clean bundle right here, this is $25 all bundled together. It would be more if you bought them individually, but you know, you got to bundle and save. And then the bar is also uh, $5 and 40 cents this month. So right there, you're getting over $30. Plus you get a sneak peek of the upcoming scent of the month for next month. And this dish soap is a brand new product. Like if you didn't get this last year or you're new to Scentsy, you probably haven't tried this. So I'm really excited about that. Um, I love that this box, they incorporate like things besides wax so you can try all of these things. So it's very, very exciting. So if you picked up this box, let me know what you think. If you haven't yet picked up this box, are you going to now that you know what's in it? Or, you know, like if you found out what was in it, then do you place an order for the box later? Do you let the video kind of decide? Let me know as well, because I always find that interesting. Um, last question, if you got the sample cup, what did you think? How was this on cold? I am gonna warm it and, you know, see how it does, but it's very interesting. I'm not sure how I feel about it quite yet. So that is everything for the Mart Whiff Box. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.